Good morning, Grizzlies. I'm Ella Quaid. And I'm Cheyenne Ryan. These are your announcements for Friday, April 12th, 2024. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Attention students, our last career speaker of the year is coming up next Wednesday, April 17th. Please note the change in date. Join us here in 5B to hear about a career in special education. Our very own Mr. Matt Saunders has volunteered to give students an insider of what this demanding and rewarding job entails. We will be in the pack Wednesday, April 17th here in 5B. See you there. The Jogs class is doing a donation drive for Marion's Closet and Yahab, two charitable organizations that help individuals within the community by providing them with the basic necessities of living. See the flyer on the screen for items that need to be donated or make a monetary donation to the Jogs teacher, Mrs. Eakin. You can also donate gently used clothing items for your hob. They will accept clothing for children, teens, women, and men. Drop off bags of clothing to room 2134 throughout the school day. Thank you. The deadline to order your 2023 to 2024 yearbook is quickly approaching. Have you purchased your book yet? Go to www.jostens.com to order your book today. Attention Art Club members, Mr. Sharla and Mr. Derrick would like to have any students who can come tomorrow morning to help work on the weight room mural. We hope to see you there. The Junior Banquet will be held on Saturday, April 20th at the Galaxy Banquet Hall in Wadsworth. Juniors will receive an email from Dr. Suber with a link on how to purchase the tickets online. Junior Banquet tickets need to be purchased by Wednesday, April 17th. Please see Mr. Lynn or Mr. Knapp if you have any questions or concerns. Buy those junior banquet tickets ASAP so we can get a count for dinner. Chess Club will now meet every Friday in Mr. Boynton's room 1307. Anyone can still join by scanning the QR code on the flyer and filling out the Google form. The WHS Counseling Department will host its annual junior college plan and night at 6 p.m. on April 16th in the pack. Students and families are both welcome to attend during our presentation. We will discuss how to get started with the college admissions process and go over important financial aid and scholarship information. We hope to see you there. This week, the Grizzly Way team is focusing on how we can all do a better job of being kind to our school. Dylan spoke to one of our Grizzly Way students leaders on how we can do a better job of taking care of our cafeteria. Thanks guys, I'm here with Stephanie. This week we're highlighting ways to be kind to our school and the cafeteria has been a problem area for the last few months. What do you think about the way the cafeteria is left each day? I think that the cafeteria I've sort of noticed is that there's always a lot of food on the floors and all over the tables and it's just left kind of gross, just like napkins and food and like condiments just left over which can be like really gross for our lunchroom. Why do you think the cafeteria is such a mess for after lunch? I just think people are like lazy about putting away their food and if they like drop it they don't want to pick it up or like deal with it. So I think overall it's just like people being lazy and not like putting away their food and like putting in the trash can and stuff. Do you feel bad for the people that have to clean it up afterwards? Yeah, I feel like a lot of our staff and the janders have to like clean it up since the kids aren't doing it, which is kind of irresponsible and just overall like doesn't give us a good like look and isn't making us responsible and cleaning up our own mess and like the janders shouldn't have to worry about that because they're mainly just trying to clean the tables. What do you think can be done to help with like keep our cafeteria clean? I think just overall students like putting their food in the trash can and just making sure they're not making too much of a mess and like cleaning up more after yourself and just overall like having more trash cans to help limit the problem. Thanks for your time. Back to you guys. Thanks, Dylan. Today's lunch menu is Fiestata pizza or Max Breadsticks salad, fruit, and milk. That's it for today's announcements. Have a great weekend, Grizzlies. Before we go, here's a look at our bloopers from the past month. Here today. Well, I've always liked it. Oh, nature documentary. Wait, zoom. You can just zoom in. It's going to jump on you. Don't tell me that. On the fire. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Photo marks from the phone. Have a great day, Grizzlies. Keeping in. Mm -mm -hmm. Mm -mm. <laughs> and that's the way it is. I, are you asleep? <laughs> Have a great day, Grizzlies, and don't forget to wear your class colors tomorrow. Okay. Wait. Okay. Hey, me here. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I am recording.
And that's all for today's announcement. Have a great weekend, Grizzlies. And if you weren't at last night's premiere of our spring musical, Back to the 80s. Senior superlatives. Check your email and complete the Google form that was sent by Dr. Suber. <laughs> Thanks, Cam. Michaela, what's your thoughts on the Shamrock Shake? I can't. <laughs> One more thing, here's Ella with the final side of our Papa Shop Mark Madness Bracket Challenge. <laughs> I just, he goes like, he's like, thanks Cam, Michaela. <laughs> Juniors, this is a great opportunity to get your senior, senior volunteer hours. Yesterday, the JOG students participated in the Jobs for Employers. Uh, Tyler, Dang it. Heavy side because we heard it. The problem is these audios are oh mixed. These audios gosh. are mixed. So when you sigh like that, it picks up and we can't edit it out. Because oh. I'm trying to make it as easy as possible. Oh, uh, you're selling. So, you gotta. <laughs> unless you guys are talking to each other.